Uh, hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how to create your own theme and for your iPhone or iPod Touch. And I have my iPod Touch here, and I will create uh, a theme. So, uh, go to this website. Here is here's the website. I'll have it in the description as well. It's called Code Themed, and you don't have to become a member, but I just did. This website's pretty cool. So, here's like I've worked on. It's pretty simple. This is just like a test. So all I did was change the music icon to that. You could like change different ones. So, and I put the text as red for um, the page and as blue for the bottom so here like you can if you click app store it should highlight the app store app which is right there and you can change it so I'll change it to this you can change it and it'll change and there's like videos you could like change the picture. I'll just do, I'm just gonna do Safari. Just do this for now. So, and I just here, over here, is the backgrounds you can choose from. I'll choose a different one. Uh, let's just try this one. Just click. Uh, it should say add to home screen or lock screen. I just click home screen because I really don't care if it's on the lock screen. So it sh the back should change. And now here's extra on the bottom. So I'm just going to lock the device real quick. So I lock the... So you could create... Uh, you could upload your own too. See, upload your own. If you want to upload, just click upload in this corner right there. So, I didn't upload any yet, but uh, let's just see. There are like a lot of different ones. So, uh, you can load more to see more of them. There's more. I'll just take this silver apple, I guess. And there is text. I'll just type YouTube test. So once that's done, here it should say YouTube test. That's what it would say. So um, that's it for that. And you can have a... Uh, unlock this. You can have a custom dock over here. And I'm just going to choose one. Um, let's choose this one. So once that's done, uh, you're going to go into the uh, top and click download theme. And it should prompt you to a downloading page here and it should say building your theme and here we go so it says download as zip which I will do that so just save it so I'll get out of that so here are all your download, well my downloads. You're just gonna drag the theme folder onto your desktop. And you can name it whatever you want. The, na the name you name it is gonna um, be the name of it in on your iPod. Rename. So I'm just gonna type it YouTube test. And once that's done, you can just open your SSH program you use. I use iPhone Box. That's not my iPod. 
I'm connecting, gonna connect mine right now. So, connect your iPod to your computer. So there's mine. So you're gonna have two iPods. Well, I have two iPods. <laughs> so, you're gonna open the plus raw file system, var, stash, and find a folder that says uh, theme. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, here's mine. Well, it's gonna say themes and have some other random stuff. And you're just gonna. I'm gonna exit that. Drag this into that. And and here it is. YouTube theme. You I mean YouTube test. But then you're not done yet. You have to rename it in here one more time. Wait, it doesn't let you. So I'm g you could just rename it here. Uh, you're gonna rename it. Once you have like the name, just write dot theme. Spelled it wrong. Okay, and then you can just drag it again inside. Okay, so once that's done, you're done. Mm, you're gonna file exit, and you don't need a respring. I do not know why. Here's another custom theme I made. Uh, lollipop. It's another custom theme I made like a long time ago. So you don't need a respring. Select themes. Here it is. Here's my first test I ever created. That's why it's my first um oldest one, but here's YouTube test. So I'm just gonna let it respring. Something came up. And I'll have a link for iFunbox if you guys want that too. This is a great website for creating simple themes. There are more icons too. But I just want to make this quick. So, iPod's done. Hold on. Okay. So here's the theme. It looks exactly like the one over there. Hold up. I'm just gonna compare it. So, so you can see the only apps that changed were the Safari videos and music and App Store. So, App Store, and uh, I'm not good with the camera, but uh, if I can find music, oh yeah, right there, music. Those are the only apps that changed, and the color is red, red, blue blue and the background and I'll show you the custom Apple slider I don't think you could see it that good but and it says YouTube test so yeah I didn't do anything to the slider power off but you can so yeah that's basically it so just if you have any questions you can comment um rate this video a thumbs up and please subscribe